she um, transforms things uh, like everyday things like dresses uh, or looks for something unique in, in everyday things. But at the same time, she also manages to win, uh, draw out or bring attention to many stories which are special, which are related to her history and the history of women through such everyday objects like dresses. For her to use the next generation to be the one recording the memories or maybe looking back and tracing the narratives, you know, from, from the dresses. And then maybe this is her way of um, actually, because making, I guess, clothes is also like a compositional, you know, uh, exercise, you know, like you have to, you know, textile pattern that you, you know, have to work out you know, what, what part will be the sleeves or how to decorate the collar or something like that. And and a lot of it is about composition also. And, and then I think if you're if you're if you're just painting it all the time, then then there's really no exercise. You know? But if what to make a collage maybe it's really it's really more of a compositional exercise uh, for me, you know. Scraps of textiles, paint, textures from paint to, to create all of these small collage works which are quite different from her huge paintings which are very polished, very realistic in how they are depicted. So it's very, it's quite refreshing to also see her collage works, uh, especially in comparison or in juxtaposition to her oil paintings. As here you can see how she plays a lot with texture, color, composition. His earlier works were around scenes of everyday urban life, what was happening in the communities, in the barangay, in the carnival or, or feria. During his first solo shows, his way of portraying people also changed. Before, it used to be really straightforward. Human figures portrayed very realistically or distorted in some way. As he developed his practice, you could see that he would use more stylized or abstracted ways of representing the human figure and he would focus on more expressive forms of representation or focus on showing psychological states. The interesting part for me is the, the use of burlap, I think, the, the material. Because it's very hard to, to make a very clean, like a clean, clean lines, you know, or, you know, the, the image will always turn out to be, to have some kind of texture, some kind of roughness, some kind of like a lower resolution image, you know, in a sense. I, I know he, he, like in the past show, he, he started using burlap again. Um, but I think now, I think it, it, it has more, I, I guess it res resonates more with what's happening, I think. The common people as his subject matter. Everyday scenes in the barangay, figures of yung tambay, people in the doon sa looban, people who were part of the whole landscape of people who we see now under lockdown. Uh, sidewalk vendors, jeepney drivers, yung mga figures sa carnival. Through time, maaaring nagbabago or nag-change ang figures. But their presence and position in society remains the same. They're among the most precarious and marginalized of people. What you, what you see every day is very mundane, but he made it. He, he made us reconsider the beauty and wonder in, in, the, in the, these details. They 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 look. They're really interesting to look at. You can't stop looking at it for hours, maybe. Which normally laundry looks boring. Yung sa style ni Rodel, like it almost abstracted enough that you don't immediately recognize now that that's what's happening you know like these are actors or these are someone training a dog maybe and i guess the information given by the titles i think opens up the link to the everyday to me um, uh, looking closely at the images to to recognize ah these are some things that i can relate to yeah um, hindi pala siya parang mythological or these are more like immediate things that we're, we all know it's not from a story or from uh hindi siya ganun ka, kalayo i guess 
Tapos what I'm saying, mm. parang ano pala siya, it's very immediate, it's very familiar and 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 abot kamay, parang ganoon. 